Ladies and gentlemen, federal employees, welcome back to this episode. My name is Dallin Haas, your host, where we dig into your questions, your the information that you need for your federal benefits, your federal retirement, to retire the way that you want, to have an incredible career and retirement, to get the most out of that and have control over your life. And by the end of today's episode, my goal is to try to convince you to at least plan to retire as soon as you possibly can. Okay, and this might for some people say like, duh, doesn't everyone want to retire as soon as they possibly can? Well, maybe not. Or maybe someone does in theory, but they're not taking the steps that they need to actually retire as soon as they possibly can. So today we're talking about why you should be planning to retire literally as soon as you possibly can and some of the things that you need to do to be able to do that, right? So. The first reason why you as a federal employee should start the planning process today and figure out the earliest possible time that you can retire and to work towards that is because options are everything, okay? There, there have been numerous studies about happiness and fulfillment and joy in the workforce and just in life. And one key factor almost consistently across the board okay, is the ability to dictate and decide your own path, right? To decide how you spend your time. Having options is key to that, that decision, that power of feeling like you control your life is having options. And even if you love what you do, even if you love your work, having the option to retire, to retire as soon as you possibly can financially is freeing, okay? I have seen how when someone is finally financially prepared to retire, they know mentally that if they have a few bad days in a row, they can afford to retire anytime they want. It almost makes them enjoy their job more knowing that they don't need it, right? So having the option to retire as soon as you possibly can can make a vast difference in honestly how much you enjoy your job. And even if you want to keep working, that's totally fine. At least you're financially prepared to retire as soon as you possibly can. Options are everything, okay? And one option that is incredible, if it's offered to you, is an early out retirement or a VERA, V-E-R-A. Basically, this happens when your agency it doesn't happen for everyone, but when an agency is trying to downsize or move people around in such a way that they want to get people off their payroll, they offer an early out retirement, which basically allows certain people with certain qualification to leave and get full retirement benefits at that time. Now, of course, you got to be eligible for the early out retirement, and I have a full video on that specifically. It's an awesome video. Check it out. So if you're eligible, awesome. But guess what? I've talked with people that they're eligible to take that early out retirement and they'd love to take that early out retirement. They'd love to hang it up. They don't enjoy their job. They'd want to. But guess what? They're not financially prepared. They're not, right? Maybe their TSP just isn't where it needs to be. Maybe they're spending, whatever it is, maybe their debt. They're not in a place where they can hang it up and actually retire, right? They're not. And so they need to keep working. They can't take that early out retirement. So what I encourage people to do is, hey, plan and prepare to retire as soon as you possibly can. And you don't know if you're gonna get an early out offer. You don't know, you can't control that. But what you can control is whether you're prepared or not to take it, right? And you can decide whether you take it or not, right? You don't have to. That is key, again, is options, being, prepared. So start today. That, that is the key message of this episode is, hey, start today. And my goal is try to convince you to at least plan to retire as soon as you possibly can. And you could always work longer. I, I think that's awesome. If you love what you do, working is great. I love what I do. I love working with feds. I love creating this content, right? But financially, I have to prepare myself in a way that sets me up for success in the future. That is just how life works, being prepared 
for life, right? Perfect. So the last key reason that planning for early retirement or planning to retire as soon as you possibly can is so crucial is because it forces you, or at least it should, to know the rules. Okay, the first system, the TSP, Social Security, Medicare, all these systems that you as a federal employee are involved in and are going to be a beneficiary of, right? And you're paying into it too, right? These systems are big, they're complex, they have a ton of rules, and guess what? If you don't understand the rules, I guarantee you, you're probably not going to use them in the best way, right? There are nuances everywhere. And so if you don't understand the rules and you just kind of saunter into retirement, then you're, you're simply not gonna get the most out of them, right? The odds of you just falling into the best situation are, are slim, right? It takes really proactive planning. And so the earlier you do that, the better off you are, right? The better, the better you know and understand the rules of retirement and money and finances and debt, the more you understand all of this, the earlier you do, the better off that you are going to be bottom line, right? And so the thesis, the main point of this short little video, our podcast, whatever it is for you, is hey, start today, do whatever you can today, and you don't have to kill your lifestyle today to save for tomorrow. I'm not saying that. You want to enjoy life the whole way, okay? I'm just saying, hey, even if it's just an investment in your knowledge, getting more serious about learning about retirement and what you need to do, that's huge too. Make an improvement today in your situation, whether it's, hey, I'm gonna save one more percent of my paycheck into the TSP. I can do that, right? Whether it's, hey, I'm going to pay one extra mortgage payment every year, I can do that, right? Or I'm going to get serious about my planning so I know what my retirement's gonna look like, I know my income, I know how those incomes are taxed. I'm going to learn more about the TSP, make sure I'm, I'm investing in a way that makes sense for me, right? Whatever it means for you, learn, do something, do one extra thing at a time. Don't overwhelm yourself, pick one thing and do it. That's huge. And the compounding effects of improving these small little things is incredible. It makes the world a difference, but you have to do it. Execution is key. You have to do it. And that's the hardest part. But I believe you can, because you're here, you're learning. You're taking that first step now, and you just gotta keep going, keep taking steps, right? So I hope this is helpful. If you wanna take more action, in the description below, there's gonna be tons of stuff, right? I, I've got a course about retirement. I've got a book about the TSP. I, there's so much stuff out there that I have for you on my website and in the description below. If you have any questions, you can submit them below. I answer them on Saturdays. I'm trying to help you be, be successful as a federal employee and federal retiree, okay? take advantage of the resources, and so many of these resources are free, okay? I give them away because I want you to be successful. So it's up to you, though, to use these resources and to plan your retirement. So with that being said, have an incredible rest of your day. I'll see you next time.